Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to solve the system of equation by the Gauss Jordan method. So we take the equation and we are going to write the augmented matrix A comma B. This augmented matrix A comma B will have the first column as all the coefficients of x, which is 10, 2, 1. Then second column is coefficients of y, 1, 10, 1. And third column coefficient of z, which is 1, 1. Y and the last column all the constants 12, 13 and 7. So we are going to reduce this augmented matrix AB as a diagonal matrix. So first thing for making the calculation easier, let's interchange row 1 and row 3. So by interchanging this, we get row 1 1 1 5 7 row 2 as it is and row 3 10 1 1 12 now we have to make this as a diagonal matrix first thing i have to make these two elements as zero so for this i have to take r2 as r2 minus 2 r1 and r3 as R3 minus 10 R1. Now the augmented matrix AB, R1 we are not doing anything. So the elements will stay as it is. This is 2 minus 2, 0. 10 minus 2, 8. 1 minus 10. So minus 9, 17, sorry, 13 minus 14, which is minus 1. In the same way, coming to the third row, 10 minus 10, 0. 1 minus 10 minus 9 and 1 minus 50 minus 49 12 minus 70 minus 58 so we got this augmented matrix and our aim is to convert this matrix as a diagonal matrix now the so next part we have to make these two elements 0 but for that I need 1 here but we have 8 so first thing we are going to take row 2 and we are going to divide the all the row 2 elements by 8 so now the augmented matrix row 1 we are not doing anything as it is row 2 we are dividing by 8 so it is 0 1 minus 9 by 8 minus 1 by 8 and row 3 elements written as it is now making use of this one we are going to make these two elements as zero so we have to take r1 which is r1 minus r2 in the same way we have to take r3 r3 plus nine times of r2 we have to multiply with 9 and add. So we get 0. So we are going to write the augmented matrix. R1 minus R2. So 1 minus 0. This is 0. 1 minus 1. Sorry. 1 minus 0. The first element is 1. 1 minus 0 is 1. 1 minus 1 is 0. Here 5. Minus of minus. It will become plus 9 by 8. It is a 40. 49 by 8. Then here 7 plus 1 by 8. So it is 57 by 8 after taking LCM. Then R2 we are not doing anything. So it is written as it is. Then coming to R3. R3 plus 9 times. So this is 0. Minus 9 plus 9. So this is 0. Minus 49. Let me write it here. Minus 49 plus 9 into minus 9 by 8. So we get minus 81 by 8. So using calculator 49 into 8. So 49 into 8 is 392. We have a minus sign. Along with that we have to add 81. So this gives 473. So 473 by 8. And coming to this it is minus 58 
minus 9 by 8 because it is 9 times of this and there is a minus sign. So using calculator 58 into 8 then with that we have to add plus 9. So 473 again 473 by 8 actually both are minus sign. Now we got the augmented matrix but still we have not converted this into diagonal matrix. So to convert into diagonal matrix we need one here using that one we can make the above two elements as zero. So for this I have to take row 3 and this row 3 should be multiplied by minus 8 by 473. So this will become 1 now. Now we write the augmented matrix. First row, second row is written as it is. Now second row 0 1 minus 9 by 8 minus 1 by 8 when we multiply with minus 8 by 473 this is 0 0 and it becomes 1 and when I multiply this they are reciprocal of each other and the minus sign also gets cancelled so it becomes 1. Now using this 1 we have to change this as 0 and this as 0 using this 1. So for that I have to do R1 and R2 operation. So R1 gives R1 minus 49 by 8 R3. In the same way R2 also R2 plus 9 by 8 R3. So now coming to R1. This is 1, it won't change. 0, this won't change. And uh, 49 by 8, minus 49 by 8, this becomes 0. Then here, 57 by 8, minus 49 by 8 into 1 is this much. After subtraction, it is 8 actually. So, 8 by 8, which is 1. Then this is 0, 1. This is 0. Here it is minus 1 by 8 plus 9 by 8 into 1. 8 by 8 which is 1. And row 3 0 0 1 1. After we convert this into the diagonal matrix we directly take the values of x, y and z. That is x is equal to 1, y is equal to 1 and z is equal to 1. So from this we get the solution directly.